Hello, and welcome to my career prospectus project. For my career prospectus project, I have decided to attend the Institute, the Georgia Institute of Technology, or Georgia Tech. Uh, to get into Georgia Tech, I will need a minimum of a 1380 SAT score, because they typically only take the top 6% of scores. Uh, I should get higher than this if I want to be admitted, because this is the bare minimum. Uh, for ACT, I will need to be above a 30. They typically only accept the top 7% of the national scores. In high school, I also need to maintain a 3.95 GPA in order to be accepted. And once again, that is a minimum. I should get higher if I really want to be accepted. Um, the total cost of all of the things that I need to apply and get into Georgia Tech is $167. SAT and ACT are both $46, and the application fee for Georgia Tech is $75. Uh, per year, tuition at Georgia Tech is $30,004, and once all other fees are added to this cost, per year I would have to be paying $47,612, or for my four-year education, $190,448. Uh, this is a lot of money, which I cannot pay for, so in order to pay for college, I'll have to take out a loan. Um, on my loan, I can expect about a 4.7% interest rate bringing my monthly payment to $352.70 per month. This is a lot lower if I can qualify for the grant financial aid, which about 71% of Georgia Tech students can, which would bring my yearly cost down to $33,780 a year. Uh, coursework at Georgia Tech is very focused on computer science for what I want to get into and as it goes on you get more freedom in the courses that you select. Freshman year I need two English courses, two math courses, three computer science courses, one lab science class, two social studies electives and a health and wellness class. Sophomore year I need two social science electives, four computer science classes and two lab science classes. Junior and senior year I get more freedom on what I take, more electives. Junior year, it is two junior design courses, three computer science classes, one humanities class, one stats class, another math class of my choosing, an information management class, and one free elective. Senior year, I take one computer science class, two information management classes, one social science elective, one embodied intelligence course, two approaches to intelligence courses, one computational complexity course, and two free electives. As you can see, they get a lot more freedom as you go on. Um, in order to get into the School of Computer Science, I have to register through an application at Georgia Tech, get three recommendation letters from previous teachers, maintain a 3.0 GPA at least, and at least a 153 in the verbal 155 in the quantitative and 3.0 in the analytical sections in the graduate record examination or GRE. To get into graduate school it is the same qualifications as to get into the school of my major except I have to have completed my bachelor's degree. I need 30 total hours of coursework. Um, 24 of those hours have to be computer science courses, which will not be hard based on um, how many hours I will be taking. Um, Postgraduate work, uh, after college I will need to get a computer science certification. The most helpful to me would be the Oracle OCE, which is the certified expert of Java. Um, this can earn me up to 10000 more per year on my base pay. Uh, I can also get an internship at companies such as IBM, 
by applying online and sending some of my coding work. A good candidate for this is well-mannered, as well as fluent in Java, JavaScript, and maybe some more languages such as SQL, Swift, C, or C+. The starting salary is about $66,000 a year if you do not have your master's, and salary can go upwards of $150,000 a year with benefits like health care, on-site sports facilities, uh, free child care, and 401k contributions. Uh, in order to save for my retirement, I will open up a 401k, and um, I will try and save the maximum amount, which is $18,500 a year, or 1541 per month. Whatever expendable money is left over after all bills are paid and um, all my discretionary capital is taken away, I will invest that money into my retirement as well. That is the end. Thank you for listening.